and welcome back to Monday Movie Hunting, the best way to start your week. And today is not Monday for me, it is Sunday. This is an inflatable rubber ring unicorn. I feel like you can't really see it on the camera, it doesn't do it justice. Oh, actually, I'll show you. This is what it actually looks like. It has like glitter in the ring part. Um, but yeah, so I thought this would be great. I'll sit in this, it'll be comfy, cool, but you can't really see it. So I tried. This is Percy the Unicorn. He is ginormous. Um, so obviously this is a holiday Monday movie not hunting, uh, which I said about last week. This is going to be a very quick one um, than, than the others. And I don't know whether it will have the pictures in. You know the pictures of the movies? I'm not 100% sure. Because it does depend on what time I get home tomorrow night. Uh, so I get home on Monday night. I then have work at 8.30 on Tuesday. I'm probably going to get back maybe about 7 tomorrow night if I'm lucky. But that might be being a bit ambitious. Uh, and then we're going to have a takeaway and things. And obviously I'm going to upload this video. So, depending on how everything goes, depends on how the video will be. Um, but this week I told you guys I was picking up two movies. Of which then a span away in my works. And I felt there was a third movie introduced that I wanted to pick up. Um, so basically, I'll, I'll go through like this. I don't think we're going to do the spreadsheet this week. Obviously, the spreadsheet is not going to be in this video because I'm I, I can't physically film the spreadsheet right now. Of course, um, which I did mention last week, it'll be in the video after. But I feel like I'm only going to do the spreadsheet for last week's guesses because this week I don't even know what I'm picking up yet. I'm still confused. I'm still on the fence about everything. I just don't know. So I feel like it's kind of tricky. So originally, I was picking up Greta, which has Chloe Grace Moretz in, who I love. Um, I'm pretty sure that's what, what it's called, and Under the Silver Lake, which has Andrew Garfield in, and I believe is it an A24 film? I may be getting confused because the other film is also A24, if also is correct. Uh, but yeah, Under the Silver Lake is the other one I was picking up, so those were the two I was picking up. And then, you guys in the comments started guessing mid-90s, and I was like, ooh, mid-90s, I had seen posters of it a while ago, I'd had my eye on it, but I'd kind of then forgotten about it. And then it was one that I thought I would want to pick up. Um, and it's written and directed by Jonah Hill, uh, I believe, and I thought that that seemed really cool. Uh, and obviously I grew up in the 90s as well, obviously it's 90s America, so obviously it's going to be uh, different. I think it's like, I'm not sure if it's Florida or LA or, I know they're like complete opposites, but you know they're both sunny and, and things. Um, I, I just don't, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, mid-90s comes out as well and you guys were guessing that and I'm pretty sure that's A24 as well so that's why I'm not 100% sure whether both of them under the Silver Lake and mid-90s are. Um, so then I was like oh maybe I'm going to pick up three and then obviously you guys know it's a mess. The Monday movie hunting pile of what is a mess. I'm going to go through it, I'm going to do a video but it's, uh, we're going to get on top of it. Now I feel like I've been on holiday and I'm, I'm more, the summer's kind of coming to an end. I feel like I'm more going to be committed to watching the movies and really kind of settling down and, and watching the movies in the evenings. For some reason I just feel like there's never been any time in the evenings lately but I've said like now I feel like for some reason now I've been on holiday and I'm coming back I feel like I can make more of an evening. I don't know maybe it's because when we've been here we've been going out and doing things all in the day and then we still had like a whole evening. So why do we not feel like we have a whole evening after work at home? I, I don't know I guess because you do things around the house probably is why but either way we have more time we're gonna make more time in the evenings to watch the movies um basically i've literally forgotten where this began i pick it up we don't know what i'm picking up so i think i'm actually i watched a bit of the trailer for mid 90s and i did really want to pick it up but then i was like oh i wasn't sure and i was all on the fence so i thought what i'd do is in the later months sometimes at the end of the year um there are like Monday movie hunt days when no films come out um, so I was thinking of doing like one of those you pick the movie I pick up type of thing which I have done before and I've picked up some good ones from that um, ones that I picked up from that I think were I remember Mission Impossible Rogue Nation like quite a few years back I picked that up and I enjoyed that one uh, there was like some others and then I think I put in there like Upgrade, Mid 90s I'm trying to think of something else that I kind of wanted to pick up but didn't Maybe Batman Hush, I mean I wasn't too sure about that, but maybe uh, I keep, keep going back to it thinking, ooh. Um, but you know, things like that, just the ones I haven't picked up, I'll put like a little poll and you guys can vote and guess, not guess, vote and pick. 
uh, maybe that'd be fun. That's what I thought. So I think I'm going to put mid nineties into that category of I do kind of want to pick up, but I'm not really going to with upgrade. And there was another one. I feel like there's been a couple this year. I've been like, oh, I kind of do want that, but not desperately want to watch it right now. I also am not sure if mid nineties kind of looks like Boyhood, which I do really like Boyhood. Um, so let me know your thoughts on mid nineties because obviously at this point on Monday, back holiday Monday is tomorrow. So by the time I get back, all the shops will be closed. So I can't even go to the shop if I wanted to. I had to pick up the movies. So basically by the time I get back and I'll this video and everything and then when I look at the comments and everything, it'll probably be Tuesday. So I won't have picked up any of the movies yet. So that's why I'm not going to do the spreadsheet. So I'd love to know your guys' thoughts on the three movies, Under the Silver Lake, Mid 90s and Greta because I haven't even picked them up if you're watching this video kind of at the early stages. But yeah, those are the movies that come out this week. Now next week is two movies. I feel like every time I say two movies, you guys add like another movie into the whole mix. I'm pretty certain though you're going to be able to guess the two that I'm talking about. However, if there's another movie that comes out next week, so I can literally only think of two right now, but I am a bit scattered from all over the place. If you know any other movies, let me know in the comments down below, um, because I would still love to know, because I do miss things. Like, I didn't realise mid-90s came out this week, um, so I do, I do miss the kind of ones. So two movies next week, one of them, obviously, I am desperately excited about the other one. I really like the cast and everything. Uh, yeah, so two movies next week. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. And then I can confirm that September will be a crazy Monday Movie Hunt month. Uh, there's some movies coming out that I'm most, most, most excited for. And I'm going to try and watch more movies as well. Uh, which obviously I've been doing like little wrap ups uh, in these videos. Speaking of which, I did actually watch a movie this week. You'll be surprised. I watched a movie on the plane. So on the plane, they had Lord of the Rings, which I was pretty excited about. Um, they. And I, I kind of started watching Lord of the Rings, but the first one, but I was kind of like, oh, it's not really, it didn't feel like a plane movie, like it kind of was a bit like much for a plane. So I actually ended up watching Mrs. Doubtfire, which is kind of like in the classic section, they did have quite a few new ones, uh, but I watched Mrs. Doubtfire, obviously it was a rewatch, obviously I still loved it, it was great, I feel like if I can't decide what to watch on the way home, I might just watch it again. Um, the person next to me this way, obviously Josh was next to me that way, I was kind of in the middle of the very middle, um, Josh, I don't know, he didn't really, he kind of started watching that new Blade Runner and then he gave up, uh, the person next to me this side was watching Star is Born, which I've only seen the beginning of, so I did see patches of that, and then the person kind of like, you know, kind of where Josh is sat but in front, so kind of like to the diagonal of me, so you can kind of see it through the seats, like the the death TV, they were watching Creed 2, which I still haven't watched yet, and I was like, oh no, I don't want to watch Creed 2, parts of it. Um, so I could kind of see that, and I could kind of see A Star is Born, but I was watching Mrs. Doubtfire, and I was surprised, I did watch it the full way through, because sometimes like, on the plane I can really dip in and out of things and just can't concentrate on a certain thing, but I loved it, it was great, of course. Um, it's always so sad about Robin Williams, because he was just amazing, always. Um, but yeah, so I enjoyed Mrs. Doubtfire, that is what I watched this week. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's going to be it for this video, it's not, you can't really see much holiday I didn't really film anything at all, or very much, so there won't be a holiday video um, as such. But at least, if anything, you got to meet Percy, and I'm going to try and pack Percy, which I feel is going to be a challenge, because i got to obviously sit on it for ages to get the air out, it's one of those whole things. Uh, but yeah, this is Percy the Unicorn, who I feel like is giant and brilliant. Um, and that's this money movie hunt. So me and Percy money movie hunting, money movie not hunting. So yeah, let me know comments. Let me know guesses down in the comments below. I hope you guys had a fantastic week, and I'll see you next week.